Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour, and this short video is about sharing live photos from your iPhone to Facebook. How do you get some of the motion to appear? First of all, if you've been watching this channel and for any length of time, you know that we're usually teaching about Google Photos for working with your photos. But for this lesson, it is the Apple Photos app that you need to use, the one that comes built in with your iPhone. You'll also need the Facebook app installed. So what am I talking about? Live photos. What is a live photo? I open up photos. And I especially like this one. Now that looks like just a regular photo, right? But it says live up here, which means if I long press on it, you see about three seconds of video along with the photo. Let's try sharing that to Facebook. You tap the share button, find the Facebook app, and share to, I'm going to share it to a private group because I don't really want to post this. And I'm going to say live photo and post. Now let's go see what that looks like. If I open up Facebook and I see the photo, it is just the still. It only got the still photo. Here's a little trick though. If you go back to your Apple Photos and you turn this into either a bounce or a loop, there's the loop, meaning she will just keep jumping into the water. Now if I share that to Facebook, I'm going to share to the group again. Now let's go look at it. Facebook and you see the motion. You won't hear any sound. So that's how you can get the motion to be shareable, is to turn it into either a loop or a bounce before you share it.